everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome to something new, something we're not done in a bit. Welcome to Naruto Mod with the brother. Hello, brother. Hello. You're back from RSE. So, oh, nice. uh, yeah, we've been doing slime for a little bit, and I don't know how much more slime we've got left to do, because, I mean, there's still a couple of things, but, you know, there's not a huge amount, so probably not going to be too much longer. Uh, so, yeah, might as well start doing a new thing in the meantime. Uh, you curious about this stuff, bro? You curious about uh, what that is? I am curious. Yeah, jump in. Go for it. Goodbye, brother. No, Sinky anyway. Sand! Yeah, anyway, so, uh, brother hasn't played this Naruto mod. He played a Naruto mod, but that was a 1.7.10. This is a newer one that came out in between that time. Ha ha! Yeah. Haha, <laughs> I got out. It also had a couple updates, had a couple of things in, but nothing like too, too major. I don't know if this mod's actually getting worked on or what the deal is, but either way, it's a mod you haven't seen, so I may as well take a look at it and get the fun out so that we can, because I like Naruto mods. I always enjoy an opportunity to play them. I like Naruto. Yeah. Anyway, uh, basic stuff though, starting off, gonna have to basically just do some basic Minecraft stuff, gather food, all that kind of thing is normal. Essentially, to unlock our chakra and all that stuff, we're going to have to get ourselves to level 10. Oh god. Which shouldn't be too hard, because... Kill things, we'll get one lock in time. Yeah. So, not a big deal. Alright. Yeah, for that though, let's have to do some basic Minecraft stuff, figure out where we want to stay. Also, yeah, using mod pack, it's just a bunch of my usual mods, 1.12.2, so there's nothing too fancy going on here. For anyone wondering... Love it's the same stuff we've used before, it's just on this occasion, yeah, Brettler doesn't know anything about the mod, so he'll get to discover the wonders of it. Pretty much. stuff we can figure out during it as well. Also, Bodunk. All old cows. Yeah, we're gonna be needing some food, so might as well start working it. Also, you may notice uh, names underground occasionally. Okay. What does that mean? But do you notice them? Not really, no. Okay, that's fine. I do forget your natural perception levels are worse than mine sometimes. Why? Don't worry about it. I'm worried, but... Yeah, we'll see when you figure out. Oh god. Oh god. But anyway. We've got a bit of time until night hits, so we need to figure out where it is we want to live. And start setting up shop and all that jazz. Something fancy, hopefully. Because big part of our so is and always shall be setting up villages, so... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That'll be something to go work on real quick. We go get cobblestone and other basic materials. Then, yeah, once we get to level ten, it will start working on the old jutsus and stuff. That'll that'll come with time. Yeah. By the way, I'm gonna break down this bamboo that I found. Found a lot of bamboo. I literally cannot remember what you can do with this stuff. What can you do with this stuff? You can make wind bells with them. Why does it say haku on the map, brother? Uh, probably because Haku's there. Who's Haku? Who is Haku? I don't know. Oh, on Fletcher Naruto knowledge. I honestly, uh, I'm not sure who Haku is. Yeah, I was literally saying to me, oh yeah, I was just watching Naruto the other day, you know, all the kill bits in the ending video. I do watch a bunch of Naruto, like, clips and stuff of random fights and, you know. Yeah. All that kind of, that kind of good stuff. Okay. Let's Still see if you know who's with Haku then. Then we'll see what you think from there. There's an idea. But yeah, oh. unlike Slime Mod, Brother has actually watched Naruto. This is one of the few shows he's actually finished and watched, really. So. Correct. That's cool. That means he actually knows things. He's probably going to forget a load of stuff. Uh, but. I know, the main, I know the main people and all that. I know, like, that kind of stuff, but. Yeah. There's a bunch of that I probably don't know. Yeah, there'll be stuff you don't know off the top of your head. That's whatever. And it's comes to the territory. Also, what earth did that thing just say to me there? Thing just announced I went into forest. Huh? Is there a village nearby? Maybe a village nearby. Interesting. There's a full city over here. What do you mean? Yeah, we don't care about the city. We care about a village. It's the city to us. I mean, I say you're actually going to have pretty good stuff in it. If you don't mind fighting through the mobs to get some stuff in the chest. So, I mean, you're, you're welcome to walk in there and go do that. 
I, on the other hand, shall take the safer approach and quickly grab some cobblestone. I also plan on grabbing cobblestone. I just haven't found any yet. Yeah. Have you tried looking underground? I have not yet. I'm in the middle of killing sheep so I can make a bed with the wool I get. Oh, uh, yeah? Because that would be smart because then we can pass night time and we don't die very quickly. Yeah, but we need levels anyway, so... Well, okay, so Brett, a, a quick thing to know is this isn't, like, the slime world. Who is that honeybee? So Why we don't have to worry about the normal slime stuff. The heck's it's different a honeybee? It is a bee woman. Oh, uh, I just found one. Strange. Yeah, so the game of Gaia mods in. Okay. It adds in humanoid monsters. Fantastic. Of various types. You know, like the senators that we saw wandering about before. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like you found stone. Yeah, I've lots on a wee cave right now. Ugh. You know. Well, anyway. Shallow. And a whole bunch of wolves here as well. Uh, what I do want to do right now. Myself an axe. Right, um... Axes. Yeah, this is a version where axes are better. Yeah, so you realize that really quick. Wait, axes are better in what way? But stronger. Combat. Did you name damage? Oh, smashing. That's it. No, this works better for me because I do critting for attacking. You do spam hitting. They're terrible for you. No, I don't. Like, I do not. Here's the thing. Axes have a much slower like timer thing. Like they're, they've got more of a wind up to okay. work. So, like, you have to wait longer and a pause? I don't know how well you'd be able to do that. Oh, no, I could do that. I could totally do that. Yeah, you probably prefer swords. I mean, you may as well just have all three, right? Really, you should have all four, but anyway. Just four? Four main tools in Minecraft. What are they, brother? Sword, axe, pickaxe, and, um, shovel. Yeah. I ne I've never used a shovel in my life. I just... Just don't, don't believe in them. Sand will move eventually. Yeah, we need to dig up a lot of it. They're kind of useful. Also, I need to delete my old map data because this map data is obviously conflicting with the last time I was in a world like this. Cool. Uh, damn it. There we go. Right, what direction do we want to go? I assume we want to start going away. Away to try and, like, you know, find a place to live and whatnot. I just don't die, really. That's my objective. What is the yeah, no, but like, we need to find a place to live so we can put chests and stuff down and start collecting things. And top of all, build a wall. Well, a village first, but a wall around the village. Okay. So yeah. that's something to... Because uh, you're playing Nara, so like, the, the primary thing you do is you build a place, you build a village and all that, you know? So why would you build a wall? It's not Attack on Titan. Because you build a wall around the village, so that's just natural. What do you mean? I, mean, I, I, I believe you. Wait, what's that stuff? Oh, that's you that's under there. Oh, nether quartz. Huh. Oh, hey, I found a hot spring. There's hot oh. spring? What does yeah, that spring I, do? Yeah, I found a mod in called the Sakura mods. The Sakura does... mods add in a couple more Japanese themed things, which includes hot springs. Does it heal you? Yes. Oh, nice. Let's build a village next to the hot spring. Oh, we can just move the hot spring. Like, you can bucket and just move the water. You have buckets? No, you can build a bucket. How do you build a bucket steel? Brother! Come here! Um, two seconds, I need to get rid of here. Quickly now, brother, quickly now. Oh, I'll just Naruto run to you. I'm not exactly the fastest right now. You don't get Naruto running in this, there's no animations. Oh. Tis a shame. Where are you? Anyway, uh, yeah, go fill up that way. Where are you? You just, you literally just, right, how bad is your perception? I, I stand out in a forest, brother. What the feck? I know, mate. Holy feck. I've watched you run past me over there. Wait up. No! I don't wonder. No! Something's coming to kill me. What yes, is that? So, uh, that's one of the couple, look, a couple of mods in for fun things to do. Chocolate Quest and Ancient Warfare is in. So, there's Those structures with bad things in them. Okay, the Spriggans are a completely different situation. Those are just evil. But that's not part of the structure thing. So there are structures in. They will create things for us to... Uh, Does it matter? To the Spriggans try to kill me now? Wait, the yeah, the Spriggans are arguably much worse than any of the uh, dungeon stuff. But, you know, so to be uh, fair, the Spriggans' eyes just let up my heart, so... Does it... I'm pretty sure it's because it's healing, but anyway. Are you in water? Yeah. 
Yeah, it's because it's healing. It's not a good thing, that's because it's now unkillable, basically. It's a plant, brother. I mean, it's faster um, than me, I was just running away from it. It's a plant, brother. You don't put a plant in water, that just empowers it. Dear, uh, dear. That does make sense, I'll give you that one. Hello, werewolf woman. Ow, holy fuck. Ninja experience required. Oh yeah, so when you fight mobs, you gain ninja experience. That makes logical sense, I guess. Well, this is gonna be problematic. Those people uh, shooting at me! Uh, oh, 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 book, 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 bad, bad things, bad things. Oh dear, that's a lich. Dodge, dodge. Ow! Oh. Oh. No, oh. no, 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 no! <laughs> I'm right behind you. No, 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 oh no, 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 no! 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 I died in a hot spring. God you were very shortly follow me there. Cool. All right, we're died. Uh, that was to be expected. There's a lot of bad things in this world. Ah. Uh. Best. Don't worry about it. It's fine. But we need to get experience. Why do one damage there? What the fuck? Probably. Well, that was me. I'm using. A no, I'm saying, why did you just do one damage there? Did you just spam hit it. No. Mm. I was chilling. I was so composed there. It was unbelievable. And we're running opposite directions from each other. God damn it. Are you going to end the city? I mean, realistically, you should be following me. Let's be real here. Are we going to end the city? If it comes to, like, who is the leader and who is the follower in this dynamic, but I'm you know who leader. is who I'm here. I'm the leader. I'm the leader. Yeah, you want to try and lead. I'm the leader. Because I already know where that will lead me to my demise. But anyway. You know nothing about me. I unfortunately know far too much about you. But anyway, there's a spawner in here. We could utilize it to kill... Zombies honest. and stuff. You're getting XP. Kind of a minotaur try. Ow! Yeah, also there's no minotaurs indoors. See, this is why you should have followed me, brother. I was trying to Did follow I... you! Why do you walk past me then? There's a map. There's a map? Oddly enough, it tells you where I am. Yeah, I'm only cutting on. Come down. I'm just coming. You need to check I'm not. Sorry, right. I'll be there in a huh. minute. Are you about to die? No. We'll see about that. Yeah, I'm Wait. gonna try to get level 10 so I get my chalk run locked, because I wanna see what my chalk run nature is gonna be. For that, by the way, bro, we need to have some inventory space free so we can get our chalk run natures. No! What? Because, mm -hmm. alright, so part of the Naruto mod, part of this will be you will unlock a chalk run nature. Why With is that a nature. Book flying at me? Because there's an evil book trying to kill you. Obviously. Fantastic. Anyway, though, uh, you have a chakra nature. Uh, when you try to use a jutsu in that element, it will it will basically be easier to learn to use that jutsu. Okay. And you have to very much learn to use jutsu. It's probably just trying to pass me again. It's I know crazy. where you are, but there's a bunch of stuff out here. No, why, why don't you just, like, you know, come in and shut the door? Look at the state of me now. Yeah. Well, we can operate in here for a moment. What's in the chest? <laughs> Nothing. An iron halberd. Basically nothing. Yeah, I'm gonna sleep in here so that I can, uh... Hello, zombie. There we are. Can we not rest now? There's monsters nearby, but does it reset my spawn point game? That's why I wanna know. How do you get in here? There's obviously a spawner around the corner. There's not. It is dark, though, so they could just spawn naturally as well, I suppose. Hold on. Hold on. I'll get some torches, then. Where are the odds of me going upstairs and not being evil? Eh, uh, there's another another one in here. Ow! Oh no, no, there's a spawner under that chest. I know about that one. God damn it! So there is a spawner in here. Yeah, just not where you were saying. There we go. Now I can sleep. Bro, come upstairs. I'm upstairs. Yo, put a bed down. Make a bed. No! Get out! Make your own bed! Hmm? What's that? Make your own beds. Yeah, I can be sure that crafting table. Let's see if uh, I remember it down. How, to, how to make a bed. Yes. Got some junk in here that we don't need right now. Dum ba dum ba dum. That, that, what do you that. mean I can't rest, brother? Go and kill stuff. Oh, it's probably because there's a whole bunch of stuff downstairs that's like, you know, causing disturbance. I will that. I right, go and get ready, please. Hello, Hello zombie. I must rest. Please don't be a major so Oh my god, there's a few of them. I may not be able to kill them all right now. Yeah, my pick, my axe broke. I need to come upstairs. 
I acquire another two. I need to eat more. I need to regain luck, my bro. health. Yeah, I'm, I'm injured only... too. I really should go and regain my health. Uh, I'm only something. at half health. Oh, uh, I've got four hearts. So I have you beat. Uh, for being fair. injured. Fair enough. I'm Try going that to break free. Wait up. Alright, there we go. Do do do. Wait for some food to cook. Come on, food. No! There we go. Luckily, we put a bed down, so now we don't spawn outside. Pretty much. So it's like I planned this. There we go. He's there slightly more lit up, so at least this floor might be safe. Yes! Ooh. All the crits! Yeah? But did you win? I mean, currently I'm trying to win. But I am fighting three of them. Is that, was that by spam hitting I just saw there, brother? No. Was that, was that a wee bit of spam hitting I just saw? I think that was a wee bit of spam hitting I just saw there. There was no spam hitting. I saw you hit way too many zombies in a time period, but oh, actually been impossible. Look back. Anyway, yeah. I'm I now got, a ninja. I get earth release. I got wind release. Wait, you got your stuff at the same time as me? How, I'm only level five. How you get your stuff then? I got a common loot bag. Oh, you got a loot bag. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, so loot bags, I've set them up so they can give you uh, cool stuff. Which can include, of course, yeah, some ninja scrolls. And I mean, stuff. I did get diamond boots as well, which is lovely. Do the way! Let me fight some people! And go for it. They'll spawn out of there. Take your pick. Yeah, anyway, so uh, I think with this game, uh, I guess actually I'll go over some of it once you actually unlock chakra. So you work on that. Get up to level 10. I need to see what the recharge button is. It is C. Cool. I am recharging my chakra, brother. So, uh... For how this mod used to work. In do do So when this mod originally came out, and still to this day, technically, uh, it, the only way to recharge chakra is to either sleep in a bed, or to stand perfectly still for an extended period of time. Okay. Which way you'll start recovering chakra. And it's very it's very slow and very annoying. Makes sense, but... Another method to introduced by my friend Inmo. He made a separate mod that works as a add-on to it. Where basically, you have a chakra regen mode. So you okay. click it and activate it. By holding shift, you will go into chakra regen mode. During which time, you cannot move or use jutsus. But you regen your chakra quicker. So, okay. basically, you're, you're meditating the mode of chakra or something. I don't know. Either way, it's far, far better than the original version. So that mod always just gets added in. It also allows us to skip over some of the stuff to get, become a ninja. Right. Getting to level 10 isn't the only thing you have to do. You also have to get Q9 stuff. But that got progress skipped. Because in most mods, game is the achievement for it. So, it's that mod is very good. Anyway, uh, yeah, once you get to level 10, though, you'll be able to test the stuff out as well. Oh, so, oh, yeah, I became a ninja. I got wind release as my primary release. Okay, um, if I don't get wind release, I will give you the wind scroll that I have on. I also got wind release great breakthrough scroll for free, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. which I'm now gonna learn. I have my first jutsu. I also got hidden and camouflage jutsu, body replacement jutsu. Okay. Sounds cool enough. Do something. So that's the thing. Do something. Uh, I can't. Okay. That'll be another thing I'll have to point out to you. So that means currently my Geki Genkai options are Dust Release, Magnet Release, Ice Release, and Scorch Release. Which, I like all of those. So Wind is... Honestly, just my best thing. I'm cool with that. Wind is a great element. I also now have Speed 2, Haste 2, and Jump Boost 2. So because of Jog Jump Mod, we now move Ninja Fast. Oh, fantastic. I'm level 8. Give me a minute. Do you get yeah. any food on you? I was kicking upstairs. Smashing. I was, uh, was literally working on that. Thought I'd get some food on the go before... We try and leave here. Yeah. Yoink. Plus, you know, we're going to be waiting for a minute anyway while we get our everything unlocked. Once we become ninja powered, like, it becomes slightly easier for us to do stuff. Not... Entirely easier, but slightly easier. Can so, you, uh, come, can you come throw me some meat, bro? Nah, you got to come upstairs and get yourself. I'm trying to do this as fast as possible. 
Like, if you come upstairs, you know what will happen? The zombies will build up downstairs. Yeah, and they'll still think, be there when you come back. I don't think that's a smart way to do it, but I think taking two out at a time is the easiest way and not try to fight them in a staircase. Weirdly enough, I could do that. I could fight them in a staircase. I, well, I don't I'm understand your shadow. I know you're not. Can I eat I'm a brain? Well aware. Can I eat a zombie brain? Try. No, it's got to mess me up. I can feel it. Hey, if you don't try stuff, you'll never figure things out. you got to try and experience things to know. Sure, why not? I did nothing. But well, now you know. There you go. Wait, I'm, you, gotta I'm... Try, you gotta try and experience stuff. Come on, give me two more zombies and I should level up. Come on. Well? Come on. I mean, there is a Minotaurus outside looking for a fight if you want no, to go deal with it. No, 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 no. My sword's also a bit to break. This is fantastic. Nick, another one. I'm going to. I just want the final kills. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, I'm, that so I'm gonna make a backup axe for when this one breaks. Probably should bring some of this stuff with me as well. No, uh, I'm in a spider web! Well, you're dimmed. No, I'm not. I'm you're in fact dimmed. chilling. Is, you've still got space in your inventory, correct? Yeah. Yeah, because you're gonna need, you need like quite a bit of space in your inventory, bro. Make sure you get lots of space. Because you're gonna get given stuff, there's no guarantee what you're gonna be given. So you can end up with like a whole bunch of different things. Wait, two seconds. I've got to jump upstairs then and... Yeah, dump stuff in the chest that I put down. Just in cash. Where's your chest at? There we go. Oh wow, you're on 1 HP. Yeah, I'd almost died because I got stuck in a bloody thingy. I didn't get hit by zombies, that's insane. Shut up! I don't choose incredible. this life. I do not choose this life. Well, but anyway. Things happen. Here, this will make you feel better. A little bit. I mean, it's not really what I was after. I was after some normal ass meat, but. Go ahead. Dig in. Just one butt. Better than what you had. Actually, apparently, it was enough to get you going anyway, so. I mean, I, I went well, and fought well. one of them with one HP. Yeah. Oh, a couple back. more. You got a wee kick to you, wee man. Yeah, I'm level 10. Got my stuff. I'm chilling. Alright, time to ignore the undead for a bit. Upstairs. Let me see what oh, I got. What? So, uh, a couple of things are unlocked at this point. Uh, you'll have got a uh, body. Th this thingy here. Body replacement, Ninja. Uh huh. Well, it's, it's just it's just, it's just your ninjutsu thing. Okay. Mainly. I have this. Uh, then you, you also get your elemental based one. Fire release! Yeah, so bro, uh, if you go into fire, you'll notice I can't see it. It's in the palm of your hand, so it's hidden. Oh. Fire so I, release! I can't see it. I got... Okay. And then I got a body replacement jutsu scroll, and I got a fire release hidden in the ash. Yeah. Do you want this wind release scroll then? What wind release scroll is it? Wind release great breakthrough. See my. Right? already have it oh, I uh but yeah so basically how this works brother uh forget your geki genkai your geki genkai timer it's after you get to a certain amount of uh jujitsu xp okay aka i think it's after you reach 150 chakra but chakra should now have showed up in the bottom left corner yeah four out of 81 yeah so the more you fight mobs that has to be hostile mobs and okay. the more damage you deal to them and stuff the, or the more you get hit yeah, that counts as well. You'll gain ninja XP, which you'll build up after you get, which I believe it's three hundred ninja XP, which makes makes one hundred and fifty chakra. Mm -hmm. A timer will start for your Geki Genkai. At that point, at any point, your Geki Genkai can unlock. Your Geki Genkai should be based off of what elements you currently have. There are some exceptions to that rule, but for the most part, it'll be a Geki Genkai related to your base element or whatever element you have in your inventory when your Geki Genkai timer goes off. So okay. you can manipulate it somewhat if you want to. What do I do By looking with at the Genkai is available, I can see which ones that relate to fire, because all, every Genkai requires numerous elements. What do For I example, do with that stuff in my inventory, bro? That is up to you. I'm just going through the Geki Genkai stuff, bro. You want to learn about this, or you want to... I do indeed want to learn about it. Yeah, so maybe give you your questions until after we're finished. Okay. Dust Release has three other races. It's the particle cell, the Chitsukage did. Uh -huh. It requires earth, wind, and fire. Uh, so meaning there's a chance 
you can unlock that. It's the most powerful Geki Genka in the game, technically. There is Scorch release. Uh, that is Fire and Wind. So that's one that both of us share. There's a possibility one of us can help with it. There is Lava release. That is Earth and Fire. Okay. So that. And there's Boil release, which is Water and Fire. Those yeah. are your primary options for Fire release. If you want to manipulate your options to a different Geki Genka, you can grab a different element and hide the Fire one. Okay. Oh, wait. You can hide your file? Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, you can put it in a chest or something. Also, it goes by what's in your inventory. Oh, right, so. so let's so you can just get rid of that and then that's it. Gone. But well, you want to grab it at some point back again because, like, you're going to need it. Yeah. You're going right. to want it. Well, that's fine. But yeah, you know, if you have scrolls that you don't want, you can obviously just shove them away if you want, that's up to you. But, um, otherwise, scrolls, you right click them and it'll give you the option to learn them. Okay, so if I right click the fire one. Yes, it will add the fire one to your fire learner. Okay. At this point, bro, you're going to want to go into controls and scroll down to the Naruto mod, where there is five keys. Nope. Naruto mod, it. five keys, yep. Yeah, so there's a chakra uh, charge key. I put that on C. That is the button you'll click to go into your chakra sheet recharge mode. See already conflicts with something? Yeah, that'll be up to you to go through all the other options, like disable things you don't need. Okay. There's also switch jutsu slash increase. I put that on R. And switch that one's jutsu. the important one here. Okay. See, right now, if you look at your uh, your skill learner yes. for fire release, mm -hmm. it should tell you what jutsu you've got available. Wait two seconds. I'm trying to change uh, things a bit to. Keys yeah, make on... sure you don't put any anything important sounding. Oh wait, you may want to adjust other mods. Yeah, no, no. I'm trying to work it. It's like chat position and stuff like that is set to like C. Is it? If you click C right now, does it like just try clicking C? Because some of the stuff's in like uh, map and. I mean, it starts charging my chakra because I just put it as C. Yeah, that's fine. Then you can. Then it's fine. It works. Okay. And it doesn't start charging your chakra, so what it does is next to where your chakra symbol is, or your chakra bar is, a little man pops up. Yeah. Yeah, so at that point you're in chakra recharge mode, but you aren't actually charging chakra. To recharge chakra you have to hold shift. There you go. Okay, fair enough. And then you just wait until your chakra recharges. As you get more uh, chakra, it becomes easier to recharge chakra. Because yeah, that's the way my faster. friend said. Yeah, my friend set his mod to make it so you got bonus after you reach certain points. Ah, right, cool. So there's that. There, um, the other one is the change mode. So at this point, if you look at your inventory and look at your fire release mm -hmm. thing, yeah. what does it say on it? Um, fire release, hidden in the ash, B rank, Jitsu scroll. No, the actual learner. Have you not read the scroll? Oh, no, I... Well... There you go. There we go. Yeah, no, I'll look at the learner. You told also me notice the scrolls are really kill when you open them. Where does it say learn though? The fire red symbol thing you got. Alright, alright. Um, fire release uh, 3 hidden in the ash jitsu XP 0. Yeah. You also notice though there's there's a number next to it. Yeah, 200. So I need to get that up. No, to no, 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 no. At the start. Oh, fire. fire? Oh, number 3. Right. right. At this point there is an arrow next to it. An arrow next to... To three. No, there's three no. next to little dots. Yeah, so there won't be. Because basically at this point, you're not selected on that jutsu. So all your fire release jutsus will go into that fire release. At which point, it's up to you to then select which fire release jutsu you want to use. That's what the switch jutsu uh, button's for. Hence why I put on R. Oh, okay. So if I press R... Press R and see what happens. Okay, that's it. It should pop up on screen saying hidden the ash jutsu. Yeah. Yeah, at any point if you check again, it should show a little arrow on your jutsu. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. And then we get to the less fun part about this mod. This mod is incredibly grindy. So, okay. in order to learn a jutsu, you don't just click the scroll and learn it. That gives you the kind of knowledge of the jutsu existing in your learner. You don't need to gain experience to use it. So you know how that says zero or whatever? 200? You gotta fill that bar up. How do so I fill use the bar? Jutsu. You have to have the item in your hand, and you have to kill mobs. What, so just punching to kill mobs? 
That is the chum way of doing it. Yes, a better way would be putting it in your off hand. Because uh... fake doing it with your main hand, put it in your off hand and use a weapon. That makes sense. Don't be a scrub, brother. But yeah, so know. at this point, killing mobs now, as long as that isn't your off hand and the correct ones uh, selected, you should start gaining jutsu XP. Okay, let's go and try it. By That's kind of the, the motion going forward. You want to start building up to learning jutsus. Hello, zombies. How did that happen? How did I just end up upstairs? Yeah, so here's another thing with being a ninja, brother. Uh, brother I would rather you... I'm going to kill you at this point. You're literally hitting me. I'm dead. I don't know what you mean. Yeah, because you were hitting me, so I killed you. Don't stand anyway. at the bottom of the stairs! But you didn't go down, did you? I did! Anyway. Go get in here! You came back up! Let me hit! No, Mouth. zombies down below! I know how I fight them! Yeah, I need to get rid of some so we can actually get down. They're all guarded around the bomb. I can yep. help! Jump out the window then! <laughs> I don't know if that's safe. I mean, apparently it is. We're ninjas! I don't know! Ah! Brother, come here! Other thing we can do now. Yes. Wall climbing! Wait, how do you do that? You look at a wall and you look upwards. Don't hit a window, you need to be in a flat block. But don't look directly up, look slightly up. Well, uh, being on the wall. There you go. Okay. See? That'll take a while to get used to. Yeah, unfortunately though, you can never turn that faking thing off, so it's just always on. So awkwardly, whenever you look up at a roof, it's going to try and hook you onto the roof. Not the worst thing in the world. That's just all the thing. Also, we're not immune to fall damage, but we do have a heavy resistance to it. Yeah, so I realised that jump. when I jumped off that roof. <laughs> yeah, we can jump from far further and things like that, but we're very little, we're little, we're little too damage occasionally, so we have to be careful with that. That'd Noted. be how it be. Yeah, I'm just grabbing but chickens. Yeah. No, you're not. We're grabbing chicken. The meats. Oh, okay. Not grabbing the actual chickens. That would be too useful. No, I grab raw chicken. I need to pick up mods actually. You probably could just grab a full chicken. Whoa! Bring it with us. What have you done? Oh, it's a midget zombie. What are you, what are you eyeing at? Just a little dumb guy. What you, what's your problem? I know. He came straight at me. I own one of the doors. No. Just I already know mods are built up. We were in the one area for forever, brother. Of course there's mobs. Ah! What are you screaming for? It's just a wee guy? No, it's a chicken that confused me there. <laughs> anyway, there is a chest in here. I know. There's also a creeper about to explode. Never mind, there's no chest in here. Wait, what? Oh, that's one of those ones. Oh, I see. Yeah, that makes sense. Free XP! Right, brother. I got the goods. Let's get out of here. What's the goods? We just found a place to live. That is a good point. Let's go and find somewhere to stay. Yeah, we're going to head south. Okay. So, uh, yeah, go this way. So, yeah, at this point we have jump boost and uh, speed. So, now we should be able to move around the road a lot more freely without a carer. Doggo! Like, we need bones for them, okay? We haven't come across a lot of skeletons. That's unfortunate. Anyway. I like doggos, but. That's a mimic. Yeah, it's a mimic. You're not the good kind that gives you, like, you RFX and stuff. Different kind of mimic. There's also a weird spider thing chasing after you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's my... Who's my she? Don't really. Don't worry about it. Anyway, let's just head down the road. Uh, I'm just seeing the world that, guys. So, um... Some fun little bits. So, you know how I love to make the world a bit spicier? You know how I made it so mutant creatures were everywhere and all that stuff? Why is stuff? Yes. Yeah. So, I kind of did the same here. Who's that guy? That's an Oni. I just want the sheep. Give us a sheep. I just right, want to not you. die. I love Oni, you're very cool, but like, you're also trying to kill me, so unfortunately you must die. But yeah, so, um. Oh god. Yeah, I, I like to make the world harder. So, yeah, I mean, I mean, getting creatures spawn everywhere. I turned off regular mobs and slime. So I was like, that'll make the world harder. Are we just continuing the this road, eh? Might as well. We're looking for a cool place to live, so I might as well just go down. There's a bunch of people in there. Okay, we run past them. Okay. Sounds easy enough. But up. It really is. I made that. Anyway, so the world was made harder. Can I take a guess at things I might have done to this world? Dragons. What is that? Is that a big No. Case? So, key thing. Dragons are in 1.12. They cannot exist with this mod. It breaks your jutsus. I have no idea why. There's well, never that... been an explanation why. 
it there's, just happens. There's a castle over there. Can we not like go and take it over? Sure. Go over to the castle and see how that goes. Okay. okay. Maybe Come not on, the brother. castle. I may have meant that thing. Oh god. Oh, you meant the ruin castle. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, we can take that over. On you go, brother. I'll In be, you go. I'll be honest, there's a lot of stuff here and I'm not happy about it. Yeah, it's nighttime currently. We really should have slept in that bed to three time before ah! we uh, made our move. But here we are. Too I late mean, now. I got inside a little bit. Yeah, then what? What uh, happened? A bunch of pe people? Yeah! God. Oh, now I've been caught. Brother, it's over for me. I mean... As long as I'm not... Oh, I can walk no, in water. They, they webbed me mid-air. I'm screwed. Never mind, I got through. I'm free. Run. I can walk in water. <laughs> I'm a real Yeah, ninja. so we're also ninjas that can walk on water. That's unfortunate. <laughs> That's so unfortunate. No, they're off to me now. Yeah, they will be. They no, no, that. no, no, no. Stop shooting stuff at me, guys. Let me regain health. Anyway, so I made the world harder. Basically, was the thing I was getting at. Why? I'm here. I make the world one. harder as is. So, do you know of Gaia's in? Do you know of Gaia adds in mobs? Some of those mobs don't spawn on the surface, though. They only spawn, like, deep underground. Yeah, I made it so they could spawn on the surface. <laughs> a lot of nastier stuff floating around because of that. So that fantastic. was fun. Fantastic. There's also this fantastic mod called Mob Increase. Do I guess what it does? Does it um, increase the mob rate? Yes. Weird. I would have, I would have guessed that. So... A potato. Uh, basically, it means that, uh, yeah, there's just a higher percentage of mobs floating around the place. Given oh, how much we need no. to grind, I figured this was a good idea and a win win for us. Yeah, you I, I believe you were wrong. Tonight. I'll see about that. Look, we are getting a lot of training out of it, so I, I don't really see the issue. Anyway, yeah. so fun fact also is Morpheus' mod is in, meaning we can actually sleep while only one person is in bed. We just need a higher percentage than, you know, half the people. I mean,. I'll be honest with you, there's still a bunch of stuff here. Yeah, some guys gonna despawn stuff. But just when you go to new areas, there won't be more stuff. So there's at least that. I'm assuming the, uh, oh god. Ooh, over here. Huh? I'm assuming the, uh, castle's out of the options, yeah. Yeah, I, you're free to try and pursue it if you want. I won't stop you. I'll be honest, I did I also have... won't go in with you, but I won't stop you. I did want to try and get inside, but... Well... You guys, that's going to be all for today. I'm going to see you next time for more Naruto more. Bye, guys. Bye.